What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, back doing some ranked single battles for Pokemon Sword and Shield. Before this video starts, you guys know the deal shows the support by smashing that like button, clicking that subscribe button, and letting me know in the comment section down below. Seriously, thank you to everybody who has supported the channel. It seriously goes a long way. So guys, in today's video, we are rocking out with this singles Roserade team. I know a lot of people in the comment section asked for a Roserade team. This one's for you guys. Here you guys go. Rocking in that front spot, we have this Darmanitan, who is an absolute beast. Choice Scarfed over here with Icicle Crash, Superpower, Stone Edge, and U-Turn. Then we got Colossal. We haven't even shown off Colossal yet, so new Pokemon alert. Let's get it. Colossal in here with Steam Engine and that Focus Sash. Rocking Stone Edge, Overheat, and Stealth Rocks with Explosion. What I actually really like about this Colossal set is it's Focus Sash. So say we lead them, we can get off those Stealth Rocks, and then if we're about to die, we can just explode out, be done with our turn, because that Focus Sash will allow an automatic second turn for us. So Stealth Rocks are guaranteed if we want to get them out. Then we got Rose Raid, the heart of this team right here, with Natural Cure as its ability, which is actually an awesome ability. So say if it gets poisoned, paralyzed, or any status condition, once it swaps out, it will cure itself, which is beautiful, which is actually so cool. I really like that ability. Rocking out Assault Vest so we can soak up some more special attacks with Giga Drain, Sludge Bomb, Shadow Ball, and Dazzling Gleam. Then we got Rotom Wash, which is just good. Most teams, all Rotoms. I think every team needs a Rotom. That just, just sounds right, doesn't it? <laughs> Rock and Levitate with the Rindo Berry with Discharge, will o -Wisp for the Burns, Volt Switch to swap out, and Hydro Punt Pump as its Stab Water move. Then we got Sil Valley right here with that RKS system, its normal ability, but rocking out with that Flying Memory with Multi Attack as its normal move with that Flying Memory, Crunch, Flamethrower, and T Bolt. Then we got my boy Extra Drill rocking that Muscle Band, and what the Muscle Band actually does is it slightly boosts all the physical attack moves. So it's not like a choice move, but it just all around slightly boosts all of his attack moves. Rocking EQ, Iron Head, Brick Break to Break Screens, and Rapid Spins to take out Stealth Rocks and Spikes and all that good stuff. But guys, if you'd like to use this team for yourself, you guys know the deal. Run the code is at the bottom of the screen. Use it up. Let me know how you guys do with this team if you do use it. Also, guys, let me know for question of the day, what is your favorite G-Max Pokemon? For me, I'm going to have to say maybe Scorch. I think Scorch is cool. Charizard's cool. And Gengar, there's just so many cool ones, but I really like Scorch. So I got to make a team with that Scorch. But without further ado, let's get wrecking in these single battles. Okay, so this guy is rocking a little bit of rain team here with that Pelipper and that Barrascooter. Then he has his T-Tar, Whisk in the back with the Hydreigon and Angie Slash. I'm going to be bringing my Roserade in that back end. Roserade can do some work with that Dazzling Gleam to take out the Dragons and the T-Tar with that Grass Move to take out the Barrascooter. I think I'm going to lead that Colossal. I think Colossal can be great. We can get up the rocks and potentially get a Steam Engine in. So I think that is the call because I can see him leading that Pelipper. So Colossal getting that front spot. Roserade in the back. Then who is going to be my final spot? Who's going to be my final spot? We're going to need something to take out. Potentially that Heliowisk. I think that, uh, that Extra Drill could be the play here. Extra Drill could potentially be the play with that EQ and that Muscle Bam. I can see him, I don't know, that Heliowisk speeds pretty well, but still, we're chilling, we're chilling. I think this team is perfect for this matchup. I think this team is perfect for this matchup, and guys, with this team, I actually decided to go into casual battles because, like, I'm very high in the ranking boards. I'm in Master Ball tier, and it's just like, this team just doesn't really, I just don't see it working out. I just don't see it working out in the ranked ladder there. But still, this team is a lot of fun, so I'm going to be using it on the casual. It's probably good to use in lower ranked battles, like, for sure. But, like, Master Ball Tears is a whole different level. But he does lead that Pelipper. He's going to set up the rain. We are going to throw out the rocks. We're going to hope he hits us with that water move, triggers our steam engine, and we can get a nice little stone engine here. Drizzle comes out. D -d 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 Drizzle. And we're going to get these rocks out here. We're going to get these rocks. Stealth in the rocks, yeah, the stealth of the rocks. I love a stealth rocks. <laughs> but guys, if you want to catch more content from me, head to the link in the description below. G25 on Twitch. We stream four plus days every single week. Seriously, come hang out. It is tons of fun. Also, guys, if you want me to use your rental code teams, leave them in the comment section down below. Seriously, I would love to use your guys' team. Make it easy for me. Let me know if it's a doubles or singles team. Leave me the code, the list of the Pokemon. And if you have an EV spread, throw it in there too. So you can go for a Hydro Pump right here. He missed! That's beautiful. That's beautiful. You love to see it. You love to see it. Stealth Rocks comes out here. Let's go. Let's go. Stealth Rocks pops off here. And I would love for him to go for another one of those. We're going to pop off into a Stone Edge here. He's probably Focus Ash. And I hope he triggers our Steam Engine. Hydro Pump comes out here again. Let's go. Our Steam Engine is going to pop off. Probably bring us down to the Sash. Let's see. Yeah. He... There it goes. Sash comes out. But you know, watch this, guys. Steam Engine comes out here. Ability. Let's go. Look at that. Speed is going to boost. Our speed is going to boost. It raised drastically. I think he's sashed here. Oh, dude, he eat that up very, very well. Eat that up very, very well. Let's look at our speed. Look at that. Look at that speed, though. 
We got speed though. <laughs> we can go into another stone edge, take him out, and I might just explode onto the next Pokemon. I might just explode onto the next Pokemon. It's probably the Barra Scooter. It's probably the Barra Scooter. Dude, that is sick. That is sick. This thing eats up rain teams. Yo, see you later, Palooper. Palooper gone! Woo! Let's go! Let's go! My boy! Colossal coming up here with that steam engine. Dude, we're plus six on the speed board. Who are you gonna go into? Show me the Barra Scooter. Show me that Barra Scooter. I will bomb that thing. I will bomb it in the next week. Is this Barra Scooter in like a different language? It is. Barra Kifa. Barra Kifa comes out. Watch this. Yo, ye explosion. Stone Edge pops off in there. Watch this. You outspeed me? We're plus six speed. We're plus six speed. What do you mean? Wow, I did not see that coming. I did not see that coming at all. At all. He's life orb with the rain. Okay, I, I, I expected the damage to come through, but I did not expect him to take me out like that. I did not expect him to take me out like that. Or uh, outspeed me. Like, that was nuts. We're plus six speed. Who outspeeds a plus sp six speed Pokemon? We're going to the Dynamax. We're going to max overgrowth here. Take this thing out. I think we'll outspeed us. I wonder what else is rocking. I can see it rocking the max ooze. He is going to max here. He is going to Dynamax here. I wonder what he's rocking into. I really do wonder what he's rocking into. No way he's going into a max geyser. I see us one tapping him. I see us one tapping him if we get a hit off. Um, I see maybe a max ooze. Um, maybe a max knuckle. Usually they rock the close combat, the poison jab, the water move. Maybe an ice move? Maybe? I'm not too sure. I'm really not too sure what he's going to go into here. I think he's signed Max to maybe try to eat up a hit, but I'm hoping we can just, like, just slap him out. So get out my face, Barrascooter. But Barrascooter is such a good Pokemon. One of the best, I think, in the new Galar. Pokedex. I really do think he's up there. Definitely Dragapult's definitely probably top tier. Duraldon's up there. I would throw Barrascooter up in a in a pretty good spot. But oh he does have the hail move. Eat this, buddy. Eat it. Eat it. Yes! We survive on five! We survive on five. You love to see it. Hail's gonna pop out here. We are dead. But can we take out this uh Barrascooter with it? I would love to get out his Dynamax with our Dynamax. Unless the heal comes first before the hail buff it. Let's see. Take him out. That should take him out. Let's go. Let's go. Rose Raid, I love you. I love you, Rose Raid. Can the heal come before the, the hail buff it? Let's see. Show me the heal first. Show me the heal first. I would love to survive another turn and get a Dynamax hit off. We still have our extra drill in the back end, which is beautiful. You love to see it. What you want, fool? What you want? No, the buffet comes out first. What do you mean? The buffet does come out first. I want the heal to come out first so we can survive the buffet. But who is his last Pokemon? This is a real call. Here comes the drill, baby. Here comes the drill. Show me the Heliolisk. Oh, you would love to see it. 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 The Heliolisk pops off here. And we're going to be crushing it here. He's like, oh, man. The only Pokemon that dumpsters me. But our stones does do a little bit of damage. And he floats in the air with an air balloon. Okay. So we cannot go for that ground move just, just yet. I said we should go for that brick break. Or do we boost our speed? Because our EQ will take him out once we pop that air balloon. Or we can just go Brick Break. Let's go Brick Break because we could potentially take him out with our Muscle Band. Let's see what he goes. He goes for a Hyper Voice. This should be not very effective, right? Yeah. We eat that up. Yo, I love how his little, his like, flaps come out. Brick Break pops out here. How much damage? That taking him out? Let's go. Let's get it. That is how it's done. Rocked out. Killed that thing with a Brick Break. I wasn't expecting that thing to die to a Brick Break, but it did. It did, which is awesome. Which is awesome. But we showed off that Rose Raid and got a W. Uh, guys, I'm a little scared. He has the Corsola. He has the Corsola. I hate those Pokemon. I hate it. It's so annoying. We're going to be bringing the Rose Raid in once again for that Barra Scoot in case he brings it. Do we bring in that Extra Drill? I feel like Extra Drill can come up huge. Yeah, we're going to go Rose Raid, Extra Drill, and then do we go Rotom? I say we do lead that Rotom as a special attacker because that would be nice. That would be actually very, very nice because I can see him just leading that Corsola. Or do we bring in the Silvali? The Sil mm, Sil Valley could be good, but I think Rotom would work out a little bit better. He has that fire Pokemon, so I don't want to bring in the... I don't want to bring in... Oh, no. If he brings in that Cinderance, that's going to be tough. So let's take out the Extra Drill. Let's say Extra Drill's gone here. Let's go in with the... We go Colossal. We go Colossal, Rose Raid. Try to set up those rocks. But I need a special attacker. Let's not lead you. Let's go in with you, Rotom. Rose Raid. No, R Rose Raid, you're going in second. And then one more choice here. Like, we need something to take out that... That, what's it called? That's Cinderace, because that Cinderace kind of runs us. So 
So is Sil Valley the call? Is Sil Valley the call? I see him leading that uh Warsaw. We have mm, I wanna bring in Sil Valley. We're gonna bring in Sil Valley here. I don't wanna bring in that extra drill because then that Cinderance just runs us hard. That Cinderance will just run us hard. So here we go. Rocking out with this team. With this squadron out here. Into our second match. This team's a lot of fun to use. This team is a lot of fun, but like I said, it's not really a Master Ball tier ranked team. But it's definitely a lot of fun. I would play it on the lower. If I was lower in tiers, I would love to play it. But the shiny Darmantan pops out here, which I'm fine with. And we are going to lead Los Ninos Rotom here. Let's go, Rotom. Get up in there. Get up in his grill. Uh, do we Volt Switch out? We could Volt Switch out. Or we can't go for the burn. We're going to Volt Switch out. We are going to Volt Switch out. I can see him potentially maxing. I could see him maxing here. Maybe going for a... Uh, but we are levitating. We are levitating, so we're chilling. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? You're first in a washing machine. Hope you brought your clothes to wash them up. Because you're done. You're done. You're not having it. You're not getting anything on us. I like how he has a little tube sticking out the side. Like, kind of acting as his arm. I think it's kind of funny. <laughs> Look at my dude. My dude's styling with that original outfit. Can't beat it. You can't beat it. Nobody ever sticks the original outfit. What are we looking good in it? What are you going to do, buddy? What are you doing? Taking it very, very slow. I see him crash. Watch. He's gonna get the flinch off. Like, bruh. Like, watch. He's gonna get this flinch off. Watch, watch. Just watch how annoying this is. Watch. I hate this game. What, what did I just say? What did I just say? He's gonna get the flinch off. He's gonna go for it again. And I, I wouldn't be surprised if he gets off the flinch again. Like, jeez, man. I'm just trying to full switch out here. He is gonna die in now. Like, what do you mean? I just wanted to swap out. Oh! It's a game, man. It's a game. This is the luck. It's just not here. The luck is not here. He gets the flinch. He's going to go into... We should be able to eat up one of these shots, I think. Let's see what he goes into. Let's see what he rolls into. Max Hailstorm comes out. Can we eat? Can we eat? I would love to see it. We do eat. Beautiful. Love to see it. We're going to Volt Switch out of here. You're out of here. He gets a crit. Holy luck. This luck is unreal for him. This luck is unreal. It gets the flinch and the crit. Like, get out of my face, little boy. Old switch pops off. I don't want to go into my rosary. I really do not want to. I am going to go into my Sil Valley. Let me check out his summary real quick. Let's check your summary, big dog. Oh, yeah. Got decent defense here. A decent defense. We're going in. We're going in. We're going to rock out a flamethrower on him. Do we dine it? Do we dine it here? Change that weather up. I say we do. I say we dine and we change that weather up. Oh, but that hail can come up huge. The hell can come up huge. I'm going to go into that max player. I'm going to say, see you later, Darmantan. I say he hits us, but I see us eating it up, hands down. Let's go, Silvali. Boosting our HP. We should go up to 320, I believe. It's double what we have. To 160 plus 160, 320. Let's go. Look at that boy. I love it. I love Silvali's design. I love it. There's everything about it. Looks dope. It's like a bunch of animals made in one. Which is awesome. Let's go. Let's rock out here. Eat up this hailstorm. Eat it up. He's not going for any moves that really benefit him. He's just going for hailstorms. Drop the hail. Yes, we do eat it up. Just what I wanted. I need this Darmantan out the way here. Bye-bye, Darmantan. And we should potentially outspeed whatever Pokemon is next. He's dead. He survives? What you mean? He survives that? Is this a joke? Is this a joke that Darmantan survived that? And now it goes into Zen mode? What you mean? Wow. I, that was the last Pokemon I was expecting to survive in that display. Uh, we don't have a guard. We do not have a guard. Uh, I guess we'll just go into another max flare. Some bogus. Some bogus goes to another max hailstorm. Changes up the weather on us. That's tough. That is tough. Bye bye, Silvali. Reason this is super effective is because we have that flying memory on him. We have that flying memory on him. But, dude, I can't believe he got that flinch off early on and that critical hit on my real time. Like, get out my face, dude. Get out my face. His Dynamax turns are over. He has no benefits from the Dynamax, which is great. So, like, no attack boost or anything. Who are we going to rock into? Rock into this Rotom. We need this thing out of the way. We're going to go into a Hydro Pump now. It should be super effective. We should be able to eat up a shot here. If he doesn't get us to flinch. Like, I know he's going to get us to flinch. It's just going to be like, bro, what you need? Hydro Pump popping off here. We need this Darmanitan out the way, please. Yo, Icicle Crash, watch this. Oh, thank you. Thank you. He missed. Hydro Pump comes out here. Yes. Okay. Darmanitan should be gone. He should be gone. Should be gone, Ski. 
Yes, okay, Darmantan is out of here. We still have a Rotom and a Roserade in the back end. I am scared if he has that Cinderance. I am scared if he does have that Cinderance, because he will outspeed us. Probably Punk on us. But I can definitely see him bringing that. I can definitely see him bringing that. Let's see what happens here. Gonna go Hermes. Who's Hermes? This is it. This is it. The Cinderance. Okay. Uh, he's probably gonna outspeed us. We're gonna go for this pumping. We're gonna get pumping out here. He has no flare set up. Well, he's gonna get buffeted by the storm. Hopefully, we can bring him down low. I don't see us outspeeding this thing. Cinderance is a pretty speedy rabbit. He's a pretty speedy rabbit. He's gonna go for a U turn. Can we eat up the U turn? We do eat up the U turn, which you love to see. Love to see. So, we're gonna get another shot off on this Pokemon. Um, what Pokemon is he going with? That's the question. That is the question. It's his last Pokemon, so Barris Scooter. You little busy. You little busy. Can we outspeed this thing? Because it is not in the rain. So we're going to get this Hydro Pump off. Imagine if we would have read that. Be like, yeah, we're going into Electro. Milk. Nope. It's a work. Not bad damage, actually. Not bad damage at all. We're going to get this little Buffet on him. And we are going to go. Mm, can we survive one more Buffet? We, I think we can. Can we outspeed? This charge is going to pop off here. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Outspeed him. Outspeed him. I know Barrish is pretty fast. Oh, he does outspeed us. Which is tough. Which is tough. I can see him potentially hard swapping, so I might just go for a sledge bomb here. And we're going to get buffed it. This, this might be a loss for us in the books here, boys. It's fine. It's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. This team's very tough to play. It's very, very tough to play. Okay, let's see. Let's see, how are we going to roll out here? How are we going to roll out? Do we go for that Giga Drain? I kind of want to go for that Sludge Bomb. Because I feel like we kill, and if he swaps out, we get some damage on that Cinderace. Let's see what happens. He goes for a Poison Jab. Should be able to eat up, right? Wow, that did a heaping amount of damage. He has Life Orb. That should be not very effective, because we are part Poison. Sludge Bomb pops off here. Okay, cool. We take him out, and we're down to that Cinderace. We need Cinderace to miss. We need Cinderace to miss. This is a back. It's a fact the hail does stop, so no more buffets for us. But oh no! Oh no! Hey, it's fine, it's fine, we're chilling. This guy's gonna miss. He got his luck early on, he's got his crit and his flinch. So here comes our luck, here comes our luck. We're gonna get a crit and he's gonna miss. Here comes our luck, let's see if we have any luck. I'm gonna pull it out of my back pocket, my luck for today. Here it is. Drop it on the table. Stab, sludge bomb, we gotta get the poison. Let's see, miss! Oh my god, dude. I See, I'm out of luck. I told you guys. <laughs> GG to this guy. That's a loss for us. We are 1-1 one one with this team. We're going to move on to that the third battle and try to get a winning record for this video. But man, man, dude, I knew that Cinderance was coming in. He's just tough to counter with this team. Okay, so we're 1-1. One one. We are 1-1. One one. We got to win this one to get our winning record. This guy's going Dragapult, Lucario, Titar Duraladon, Corviknight, and the Hippowdon. This guy is... Full out physical attacking besides that Duraludon. Full out physical attacking besides that Duraludon. I want to bring in that Rose Raid. I love Rose Raid. Such a cool Pokemon. It can do work against a Hippowdon. Um, against the Dragons. So Rose Raid, you're coming in here. Only tough part is they're all physical attacking. I gotta watch out for a Flamethrower. Maybe rocking on that Dragon Ball. Um, I am gonna bring that Darmanitan too. Do I lead that Darmanitan? No, I do not. I need something to take out that Lucario early on. So I think I am gonna go with that so Bali. I think he's leading that Lucario. I think he's going Lucario into Ch Ch Dragapult and hit Powdon or Corviknight. So I think Silvali's a great lead. I think Silvali's going to get that lead into the Darmanitan and Rosary. That's cool. Is that cool? Silvali? Darmanitan? Rosary. I think that is the call. Where do we go? Colossal. Colossal, nah. Nah, 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 son. Nah, we rolling out with this squad. We rolling out with this squad. So I'm going to try to get... I'm hoping he leads that Lucario. We can maybe go into that uh, our multi-attack, which is flying because of the flying memory. So that should be able to one-tap that Lucario. We can say night-night to him. And he doesn't really have anything to take out my Sylveon in one hit. There's no way he's rocking an electric move. Let's see, Lucario? Lucario? T-Tar? No! <laughs> okay, so he goes to the T-Tar. That's kind of tough on our end. That's tough on our end. I see him going into a rock move. Sandstream is going to set up here. We cannot stay in here. We cannot. We just can't. It's just a fact. We cannot stay in here. We are going to swap out here. We go into the Darman. No, we are going to go. We are going to go into our Rosa raid here. I can see him potentially just going for a rock move. 
Then I can see us outspeeding getting that Giga Drain off, which would be huge. Which would be huge. If he doesn't Dynamax, please don't show me Dynamax. I'm going to put my headphones up here. What we do in the stream. When something bad happens, we put our headphones up here. But I'm going to hope something bad happens and neglect it. It's already putting it up. Okay, cool. Cool. Dark Pulse, we should be able to eat up. All right, Dark Pulse, we eat up. Beautiful. We get buffeted by the Sandstorm. And we should be able to outspeed this thing. We should be able to outspeed this thing. Go into a Giga Drain. Get some health back. Maybe Trigger's Weakness Policy. Maybe trigger sweeps as possible. Giga Drain pops off here. We should get some health back here. Nice damage. Let's go. Get some health back here. You can see potentially going into yet another Dark Pulse here. And we get some energy back. We get some energy back. Dark Pulse pops off again. We know we outspeed. That did some damage. That did some damage. We can buff it up by the Sandstorm. You can see us eating it up again. That's the thing. I can see us eating it up. Show me this crit, though. Show me this crit. Giga Drain going to pop off once again. Is he going to swap? Is he going to swap? Nope. Giga Drain. Show me the crit. Show me the crit. Mmm. No crit, but we are going to get some health back here. We are going to get a teensy bit of health back here. And she's going to go for another Dark Pulse here. We do outspeed all day. The Rosary coming up clutch here, being able to take out this T-Tar. Uh, do we die to the Buffets here? I don't think we do. I think we survive another turn. So Giga Drain's going to pop off here. What is this guy going to do? Does he have Protect? That would be a smart play to go into Protect. That would be the smartest cookie play I've ever seen. But he is not a smart cookie. I'm telling you right now. We're going to get this winning record in this battle. Rosary, come on, girl. Come on, girl. Show it to me. Who's he gonna... I can see him swapping, but for what reason? I would just let the T-Tar die out. Because T-Tar doesn't really outspeed anything here. I mean, maybe to set up the Sandstorm again, that could be huge. So that would be the only reason. He does not stay in. The Giga Drain will take him out. We will survive another Buffet here. We will survive a Jimmy Buffet. <laughs> I love making up names for stuff. We go back to 21 health. We will survive on this Buffet. Um... Who's he going to go out into? That's the real question. That's the real question. Hopefully we can outspeed somebody and somebody that we can Giga Drain and get some health back. That would be lovely. That would be lovely. It's a dragon. I think he's going to be Dragon Pult. Lucario. We are not going to outspeed this Lucario. At all. I don't want to swap out. I do not want to swap out. Uh, I think Shadow Ball lower special defense. Yeah. Go into a Shadow Ball in case we get something. I see an extreme speed popping out here. A nasty plot. Okay. This thing's special attacking? Okay, we'll lower his special defense. Shadow Ball. Yeet. Do some work on him, Rose Raid. Love to see it. Nice damage. Lower it. Lower it. Samstrom does subside. You love to see it. Love to see it. Okay. So he goes into a plot. I have my Darmanitan, so I can potentially see us outspeed that Darmanitan. Uh, Shadow Ball. We're going to go into yet another Shadow Ball. Let's see what happens. Dark Pulse pops off here. Do we outspeed with our choice bandit, boy? With our choice bandit, boy. What, what, I never, you never see those, uh, those, what's it called? It's Dark Pulse. Um, we are flying. Oh, man, who do I see his last Pokemon being? Maybe a Dragon type. That's tough. I want to get my Darmanitan in here. Or do I just go off with this thing? Because what does he have that's going to take us out? Fine. There's no way he's rocking a Lightning Loop. There's no way. There's no way he's rocking a lightning. That's, that's my call. Or a rock move. Like, there's no way. Do I Dyna? Set up the flare? I said we set up the flare. We gotta take this thing out. Is he gonna Dyna too? We are Dynaing. He is not Dynaing. Because if he would have Dynaed, he would have got uh, first animation and all that. Because he is gonna be faster than us. He nasty ply. That's smart little cookie. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. You never see special attack in Lucario. So. Like, what is that? The Sabai boosts his HP to 340, which is awesome, which is dope. The Maul on Sabai, we gotta get this win. Oh, we outspeed! Wow! Wow, take him out! Yes, Sabai, yes! Let's go, we outsped! We outsped, but that Roserade came up clutch for us to, by taking out that T-Tar, because if that T-Tar was in here, he would have slapped on the, my whole team. The Roserade did come up huge. Come up huge. Alright, it is a 2v1. Who's this last Pokemon? Do we have this in the bag? We have it in the bag. I think we have it in the bag. Max Darkness comes out. We're super effective on this end. And we have our choice Scarf Darmanitan in the back end. Let's go, dude. We're going to pull off a winning record here, which is dope. Unless I get so unlucky, start missing attacks. He gets lucky crits. So, I can see that happening. Like, I'm not going to call out the match just yet. But we outspeed that Lucario. So, maybe there's a chance we outspeed this uh, Dragon Ball. We do, that's game, because I don't see this thing uh, one tapping us. I really don't. Well, I see my what's called outspeeding it too. My choice scarf, Darmanitan. 
which is dope. Which is dope. What you want? Come on, winning record. Show it. Show it. Show it. Let's see. He outspeeds us. Max Phantasm pops out. We should be able to eat. Nom, 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 baby. Let's go. We eating out here. We eating, baby. He's going to drop our defense, which is fine. Here comes that Max Darkness. How much damage are we going to do to this thing? Show me a decent amount. That's a decent amount. Now we are going to roll into just another, what's it called? Another. Oh, we can. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This thing is weakness policy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Max Steel Spike pops out here. Can we eat a Steel Spike? It's flying. Oh no. Oh no. Boost's defense. Oh no. Dang, dude. I thought we had this one in the bag. Oh my lord. See, was it a weakness policy, Dragapult? Can't be serious. Darmanitan, I need you here, big dog. I need you here. I need you here. I need him to outspeed. I can see us maybe outspeed him with this scarf. Let's go for it. Go, oh, Icicle Crash. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I need you here. We got speed. Take him out. Take him out. Yes. Yes, dude. Darmanitan comes up big. I thought that was going to be like our Silver Valley was going to take it out. But nah, dude. That came out a little bit closer than I thought. But we get that winning record. Darmanitan with that choice scarf comes up big with that ice circle crash to get us that W. Let's go, baby. Let's get it. That is how it's done. We ended up with a winning record with this team. Here's one last look at this team if you would like to use it for yourself. Rental code is at the bottom of the screen. I actually did really enjoy this team, especially with that Roserade and that Natural Cure and all that good stuff. Definitely a fun team, but I wouldn't really bring it into high rank battle. Like Master Ball tier, nah, I wouldn't bring it there. But anything below that, yeah, dude, take it in there. Have some fun with it. Get some wins. I bet you you can do some work with it on the lower rank ladder. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. Also, guys, let me get some of your rental codes. Leave them in the comment section down below if you want me to play your teams. Remember, make it easy for me by telling me if it's a singles or doubles. Leave me a list of Pokemon. And if you do have an EV spread, leave that along with it too. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everyone.